coming up next. The Penn Area Library. Oh, the Penn. The Penn Area Library has many fun events planned for this month. We will share their exciting activities. The Media Center offers many great speakers. We will tell you who they are and how they can help. All this and more on today's episode of Wake Up Warriors. Live from Penn Trafford High School, this is Wake Up Warriors. Wake Up Warriors starts now. Good morning, Penn Trafford. I am Phelan and welcome to Wake Up Warriors. Today is Wednesday, September 29th. It is National Coffee Day today. To celebrate, the coffee shop is selling their coffee for half off. On the desk, we have a caramel and vanilla iced coffee and a caramel cappuccino. Come on down during your study hall to, to drink a coffee that's perfect for the fall. And while you're there, you could try out their new candy cookies. Last Thursday, the Penn Area Library uh, held, held their after school artist club for children. Oh, for children's ages 8 and up, we sent Morgan Fong to observe the children's amazingly creative works of art. On Thursday, September 23rd, the Penn Area Library held Young Artist Night, where kids had the opportunity to create works of art inspired by Picasso. I spoke to Laura Evans, the Youth Activities Coordinator, about the event and future events. Today, students are making 3D Picasso portraits in our After School Artist Club. They are rolling dice to come up with truly random features and then stringing it all together with paint and other art supplies to create something truly unique. Earlier in the day, we did our pre-K Picassos where we made Keith Haring inspired pop art using paint and bubble wrap along with other materials. Next week coming up, we have on Thursday for our pre-K Picasso Seussical Sculptures, where children will be using Play-Doh and other building materials to create something truly fun as if it just walked out of the world of Dr. Seuss. Later in that day, we have a teen advisory board meeting, and our teen advisory board is open to all teens, 8th grade and above and we meet the last Thursday of every month. It's a fantastic way of earning community service hours, both in person and virtual. Next week is also Band Book Week, so we have some fun Band Book Week events coming up too. This is Morgan Fong reporting for PTTV. College and School Technical Career Night will be held Wednesday, September 29th. It will be held at Westmoreland County Community College at Youngwood at the Student Achievement Ch Center from 6 to 8 p.m. A financial aid session will also be held at 5.30 p.m. If you are interested in learning about running a business or going into the a Navy career, the Media Center will have two career speakers coming up next month that you may want to attend. We spoke to two Media Center interns to learn more. Tickerhoff. And I'm Mia Krystalowski. And we're Media Center interns. The Media Center has a couple career speakers coming up and here's the info. Lori Gass, the owner of Tropical Smoothie, will be coming in on October 5th during second period in the LGI. Please check your email for signups. Petty Officer Jonathan Grantham will be here on October 15th during second period in the LGI talking about a career in the Navy and scholarships. Check your email and the girls and boys cross country teams ran against Franklin Regional in Ligonier Valley this afternoon. Chloe Bronson came in first with an impressive time of 21 minutes, followed by Amelia Barillo who run a run and 2149. Victoria Davis finished with a time of 2637 and Morgan Cole came in at 3048. Chloe and Amelia have consistently placed first and second at our tri meets against Hempfield, Norwin, Derry, and York. Varsity Field Hockey defeated Hemfield 4-2, with three, scores, uh, three goals scored by Ava Hirschberger and Maddie Keenan with the last one. PT moves to 7-0 in the season. JV Field Hockey was defeated by a score of 1-0. Tonight in sports, the girls' golf team takes on Gateway at Murraysville Golf Course. The Norwin and Penn Trafford rivalry continues tonight with boys' golf at Manor Valley Golf Club. The boys' soccer team travels to Pittsburgh for Central Catholic for a 6 o'clock game. Our girls' tennis team faces the section doubles tonight. Good luck to all our Warrior sports teams tonight. That, oh. Senior portrait makeup day is today. Seniors who need the portrait taken for the yearbook uh, should report to the auditorium during their English class period. See Mrs. Thornton in room 138 with questions or concerns. Attention seniors, the yearbook staff is selling class of 2022 t-shirts, long sleeved shirts, crew neck sweatshirts, and hoodies. Please check your email for the form to place your order. 
All orders are due by Friday, October 15th. Orders without payment will not be placed. See Mrs. Thornton in room 138 with questions. Do you love law and want to learn more about the justice system? Mock trial will have a general information session and initial meeting on Wednesday, October 6th after school until 3.30 in the Media Center. We will discuss the nature of this year's competition and what to expect as a team member. We hope to see you there. Thank you for watching Wake Up Warriors. Please stand for the Pledge of the Flag. I'm Phelan. Have a fantastic day, PT.